Hey guys, I'm Josh and welcome to Penguin. I think that's the mayor. He doesn't really say much. In Australia, there's a small town located in the state of Tasmania called Penguin. The beach is a popular spot for the local penguins to rest at night, which is how the town got its name. And they've really embraced their mascot. I interviewed some locals and some tourists to find out how they ended up in Penguin and what they think of this charming little town. And what brings you to Penguin today? Just come for a drive. Just for a drive. Just for a drive, yeah. Something to do on a Saturday. We just saw a sign, yeah, we saw yeah. a sign. It said Penguin, so we thought we'd check it out, so. Wow, okay. It's quite a surprise, isn't it? It, it is. It's, it's like... a big penguin. <laughs> I came here from Brisbane expecting the town to be run by penguins. And I'm uh, a little disappointed, I'll say that. Look, I, I think at any time it could be overthrown um, by these penguins because <laughs> there is a lot of penguins from the rubbish bins to the visitor information centre. There's there's quite a few. Yeah, we're from Sydney, so we've, we've come away just for a weekend. And yeah, we always enjoy it when we stay here. So you came from Sydney specifically to Penguin? Yep, we did. So what brings you to Penguin today? Uh, Coffee. We came to have something to eat and, and coffee. We're, so this is uh, just a stop through sort of? Yeah, yeah, yeah we just called in there. For lunch. Yeah. Some snack and uh, get a coffee. I live in Penguin and I work down at the motels resetting them for guests that come on holidays. Where are you guys from? You're from here? We're Penguin? from Penguin, yes. Mm -hmm. Yep. And how long have you lived here? Uh, I, most of my life, which is probably 50, I've probably lived here for about 50, Years would it be? Oh, roundabout. Yeah. Well. Yes. And what about you? Well, <laughs> well, my parents were born here. Although I was born in Launceston, but after the war, when my father came back from the war, we came back to Penguin, yep. and I've been here ever since. What do you think of this little town? Yeah, it's very nice and clean. It's a lovely little thought. spot. Bigger than you thought? Yeah, it is bigger than uh, bigger than we thought. I think it's really tidy. It's a neat little town. Um, the locals are really friendly and I like that it's, you know, wide open spaces and there's not that many people here. Yeah. That's a bit of a draw card. So what do you like about living in Penguin? Oh, Penguin has just been a little town that has got personality. It's got a lot of character. Uh, the people all re represent that character as well. Uh, I love the sense of community that we have here. People are friendly and helpful. Um, it's fairly quiet. We have perhaps not as many services as we have but in other areas, but it's not far to go to out, out to the town. I love being near the sea. Just the scenery, yeah, casualness to sit around. We just sat outside and had some lunch. It's really nice, little shops, good service, everyone's friendly, beautiful view with the ocean. It's not very commercialised either. It's awesome, it's really friendly, it's a really cute town, yep. beautiful coast. You won't find a more beautiful town. It is just lovely, like we've got walks that will take you through to Cradle Mountain, we've got bush walks up there that are just trees that are endemic only to Tasmania that you won't see anywhere else in the world. So it's just beautiful. Yeah, what do you think? What do you think of Penguin? Do you like it? Yeah, I like Penguin. Yep. What are, what's so good about it? What do you like about Penguin? Well, I like the penguins, like they're on the rubbish bins everywhere. Yeah. I All think the that's penguin cool. stuff. Yeah. yeah. You live just outside Penguin, yes. but you come here every now and then. What, what do you like about the town? Oh, no. It's quaint, <laughs> it's beautiful, the people are nice, there's always lots of dogs. Dog watching is yeah, great. I come here primarily for a dog. Dog? <laughs> what about the penguins? No penguins. No, we haven't seen any penguins. We live in Bernie, so I see the penguins all the time. And that's the big thing that everyone talks about seeing penguins in penguins, and there aren't any penguins in Penguin, funnily enough. Where so, are they all? Yeah, they're all on the other side. I can't remember the name of the town, but they do give you instructions on where you can go to see the yeah, penguins. Right, right. Yeah. So I'm from Brisbane, but it was my understanding that this town was run by penguins, but ah. what's, that doesn't <laughs> seem to be the case. No, no, no. Um, I, I'm not 100% sure, but I think um, they do actually get penguins in on the beach here. I have a feeling they run everything behind the scenes. <laughs> yeah. the, the mayor is actually a penguin, but... Oh, we've got lots of, lots of, um, lots of... Inanimate penguins? Yeah, inanimate, that's yeah. the word, inanimate penguins. There's, there's it's few either end of the town that, that come up. 
Dare I say it, when I was a little girl, all along here, it was bush, and us kids used to just get in, in the bush, jump over them, the penguins while we were playing hide and seek and everything, and it was a, it was a real pain, and they made so much noise. <laughs> But it was wonderful, but of course progress came and took away the bush and so the penguins didn't come down anymore. But it was really a very magical thing at that time, but we didn't realise it when we were that young, obviously. If, yes, you certainly can see the penguins all along the coast here. Um, not so much here on Penguin Beach anymore, it's too uh, populated. So where do you see the penguins? If you go to... Uh, not the next beach, but the next beach along, which is along Sulphur Creek. Yes, yep. there's penguins all nesting there. If there's any penguins watching this video, is this a safe place for them? Can they come here? Yes, <laughs> definitely. <laughs> I oh. think they're loved by all here. So given, given there's so many dog walkers here, I'm not. Yeah, oh. I think it would still be uh, quite the penguin friendly. Dogs a risk to the penguins. It certainly is a safe place to come for the penguins. Yes, <laughs> they're very welcome. They are. <laughs> there's the mayor over here. <laughs> so it's quite a small town. Yes. Do you guys want more tourists to come here or you don't want it to get too big or what would you say to anyone that's thinking of coming here? It's lovely to come and have a look. We're happy, we're, we're more, very friendly, love people, love people to come and visit as long as they leave it in the nice condition that they find it in. They do want tourism here um, and uh, yeah, I think the council will keep it unique. Um, there's lots of attractions for the for the arts, the local arts people, to uh, do things around here. Tourists are always welcome because how do we generate money here in Tasmania? It's very hard to make an income here, and yes, so the tourists are most certainly welcome. Yeah, if you're thinking about it, I think you should definitely do yourself a favour and come and stay in Penguin. Cool, I'll agree with that. It's a pretty cool town. It is. <laughs> yeah, definitely. Thank you very much. Thank you.